And Father Robert from Gadget at the techstop.net, the place where it's always time to get your geek on. We've got one more stop here at Goal Zero, CES 2012 at the Venetia. Again, standing next to Alisa Perry. So good to see you see again. See you again. Thank you. Now, we saw your solar panels. We saw your Sherpa 50. What in the world is this? <laughs> this is a big one. This is basically going to replace a home gas generator. It's 1,250 watt hours of power. That translates to being able to run full-size refrigerator two to four days, deep freezer eight days, you want to watch your LCD screen, 35 hours of power. Um, what's really neat about this is there's no emissions, you don't have to worry about noise, completely silent, and it's portable so you can take it with you. Right. Now, I know this thing weighs 100 pounds so you're not going to want to drop it in your backpack, no. but when you mean portable, you mean this, this could power a household and you could just put it on a little hand truck and move it. And move it around, That's yeah. fantastic. Now, you've also built a couple of features into the device right. that, that separated even from some of the smaller units. Tell me about this. So what's really neat about this, it's an easy, easy, we want to have you know power and play. So you can turn the entire device completely off, turn it back on, can turn each of the different ports back on and off. You've got AC, you've got USB, 12 volt. You can really plug out whatever you need to into this device. And you can turn them on and off individually, so if yes. you need to conserve power, you bring up the USB just to charge your mobile devices, or you, right. you bring up the uh, the car adapter if you've, you've, got, yeah. you've got that. And this can also be charged from multiple sources, yes? Yes, yeah, so you can charge it from, a, from the sun. This is a 30-watt solar panel. I'd recommend four to charge it in a full day of sun. So that's 120-watt hours of power going into your battery pack. Yeah. And one of the cool things about the Goal Zero technology in general is it seems like almost everything has been designed to be daisy chain. Yeah. These solar panels, actually have a, a connector on the back that allows you to connect up to four of these. And, yeah. And that would give this a complete charge in about, what, 10 hours of direct mm -hmm. sunlight? So full day of sun. Yeah, so full day of sun, full day of power. And, and even these lights, these lights are designed to be daisy chain. And you, you, tell, you told me, what's the specs on these? 270 looms, extremely bright, and they're each one's only taking a three watt draw off at a time. Not uh, bad. And again, I was telling you, this kind of reminds me of younger days when uh, you used to capture uh, glow bugs and fireflies in, in jars, uh, a little bit brighter, but just as cool. Now, where do we see this getting deployed? Um, you're really going to want to, you know, have this anytime when there's an emergency. So we're going to be selling at Costco, Lowe's, um, emergency preparedness websites, things like that, and always at Goal Zero. Now, if they want to find out about this monster behemoth, this 1250, where do they go? GoalZero.com. Okay, and of course. If you had a chance, you should drop by a convention center or a show and, and check it out in person because it is quite impressive. Yes. Thank you very much thank again. Thank you so much. Thank you for showing us your tech. Thank you for sharing the vision of Gold Zero. And thank you for watching. Stay tuned because we're not done. We got more CES coming right at you.